Hey, this is Winky Pig, one of the tiny stoves that I manufacture. This one's been ordered with all of the extras. It's got the glass on the door. It's got the swing away simmer plate. It's got a heat shield and you can't see from here, but it's got a grate in the bottom so that it can also burn coal. Now the heat shield. This is the first time that I've done a Winky Pig with the heat shield on the back. And I'm gonna take this opportunity to show you the difference that it makes. With this, I'm gonna take the temperature of the hottest part of the stove, which is right here at the flue stem. And then we're gonna have a look at the temperature on the back of the heat shield and just see what the difference really is. So we've got 447 degrees on the back of the flue stem. But it's only 145 degrees on the back of the heat shield. So you can imagine that with a heat shield like this, you can place these fires much closer to the wall in a tiny house or a house truck or cabin situation. You will still need something on fireproof on the wall with an air gap behind it, but the double heat shield idea makes a massive difference. Come around the front and have a look. So the air slide's not in yet, the handle's not on, and it hasn't had its glass fitted. But you can see that Winky Pig is a little guts. She'll take huge pieces of wood for her size. You can cook a steak on the top, and with the swing away simmer plate, you can move that to one side, keep the vegetables warm while you're doing the meat. If you like the look of this, check out my website. Just search blazing stoves on the net, you'll find me. If you're into wood stoves or rocket stoves or rainwater harvesting or recycling or reusing or repairing or growing your own or goats, you need to have a look at my other videos. Why not subscribe? While you're down there, hit the like button.